Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today we are going to make soft and spongy dhokla at home. First, we'll take the main ingredient to our dhokla which is besan and I'm adding haldi to it for the color. You can add haldi water if you like. Now I'm adding salt and yogurt and mix well. Too much haldi will give bitter taste to our dhokla after cooking. Now combine all the ingredients to a batter. Consistency of the batter should be this thick. You can add half a cup of water if you like, but for me this is okay. Now we're going to keep the batter for resting for around 15 minutes. The secret to our spongy and soft dhokla is eno, which will help our dhokla to get its soft and spongy texture. Mix well and transfer it to a mold and steam for around 15 to 20 minutes. Meanwhile in a pan add oil, curry leaves and mustard seeds or rice. Let it temper then add green chili slits and stir. Now add sugar and water and stir well. Turn off the flame and add chopped coriander leaves and half a lemon juice. You can put a knife or fork to check if it's done. Cut it into equal squares with the help of a knife. Pour the temper on a warm dhokla and enjoy. Don't forget to like, comment and subscribe to my channel.